Mania day 12. As you can see, I went to a lot of trouble this morning to record this. I've got my whip of the day on my bed and it's even a little bit messy this morning. There's my afghan made by my great grandmother. It was quite cold in here last night. I had to turn the heat back on and uh, cozy up under the afghan on top of the bed last night. But it was quite a nice, quite a nice sleep last night. It was quite cozy. So today's whip that I'm going to work on is Frederica by Carriage House Samplings. And I know that uh, I had said yesterday I would be working on Quaker Diamonds if I didn't choose it as yesterday's whip. But I am traveling today. I'm going somewhere for this evening. And it's a bit of a surprise. So I'll share that with you tomorrow where I'm headed tonight. So I'm taking this with me as my whip of the day. As you can see, I did a terrible job organizing my threads. I sort of threw everything in the project bag and left it from the last time I worked on it. I think I was bobbinating as I used the colors. So today's job might be to get myself a little bit more organized uh, or just stitch. Who knows? Who knows what the day will bring? So this is today's whip and I love the fabric. This is a, this is an even weave. Picture this plus, doubloon. Is it picture this plus that makes doubloon? I think they do. Somebody please correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, can't wait to get stuck in. I love this fabric. I love the color. I think the color of the floss on this fabric is absolutely perfect. Can't wait. So that's today. So here's a, an updated bit of video on yesterday's whip. As you can see, I've got it on my floor frame from stitching it last night. I very sadly have to frog this section in here that I did late last night because I miscounted and my top row I did five stitches instead of four which threw everything over by one so that has to come out but fortunately it's not very much I also finished I completed down here last night and I started this and I did that that was about it so no great shakes, but better than nothing, sadly, about the frog. However, I am not going to frog it today. I'm going to put it away and do it next time. I'm, I'm really enjoying this stitch, so I have a feeling I won't be putting this one away for long. I'll suspect that, knowing myself, I will probably take this one to the cottage, as well as Shades of Blue, to make some major stitch progress over the summer. Can't wait. Anyways... That's it for me today. I will see you tomorrow. I will also have a very short second video put up yes, uh, sorry, not yesterday, tomorrow, getting my days mixed up, for the knitting tutorials. I have a little introduction video and I did it with my friend Louise, Wildflower Wool, the woman behind the patterns. So that will be up tomorrow, which is Sunday. Tomorrow's video will be posted later in the day because it's Mother's Day, and I fully intend to sleep in and stitch lots. So I'll see you later tomorrow night. Mm -hmm.